Wound Closure Corner In certain lacerations, the wound may appear as a V or Y shape. To reduce tissue ischemia to the tips of the triangular flaps, there should be as few sutures as possible at the tip. An elegant solution to this problem is the corner or Y suture. First, insert the suture along the non-flap wound edge, aiming towards the triangular flap exit in the subcutaneous layer. Reload the needle on the driver. Next, insert the needle entering and exiting the tip of the triangular flap only in the subcutaneous layer, being sure that it is at the same depth at which you exited earlier. Failure to do so will cause the flap to be at a slightly uneven level from the rest of the wound. Next, reload the needle on the driver. Insert and advance the needle through the last wound edge at the same depth that you exited just prior. The needle should exit through the intact skin. Pull the two ends of the suture taut to check if the corner suture adequately approximates the wound edges. If so, tie a knot as described in the simple interrupted suture section. Finally, cut the suture.